Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 21st. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. This could resonate at any time. Uh, I see the Ace of Pentacles. The Ace of Pentacles is a new opportunity, something you can touch, or there's a golden opportunity that is going to be presented to you. This is a big opportunity that you can bank on, but you have to take it. You have to take those steps. You have to grab onto it. So I feel like somebody has a golden opportunity that is going to be right in front of them, but you absolutely have to grab it. This is something that you can touch, okay? You can touch this. It's something... Um, physical okay this is a golden opportunity that can uh, grow it can grow into something bigger all right uh, but you have to find your determination at, to go after it okay you have to be determined determined to grab on to it it's going to take determination because I want to say determination okay um, you have to move forward you have to take those steps it's like the opportunity is right there but if you don't take it it's going to slip away Okay, it's going to slip away. You've got to take it. The minute it's in front of you, you have to grab it. You grab it. Okay? Don't think about it. Don't um, <laughs> procrastinate. Take it. Take the opportunity. Um, let's get two of these for an overall energy. anxiety it is reverse when keep it reversed that is letting go of anxiety so that's coming out of a, a situation where there was a lot of anxiety it's starting to feel better it could also mean when it's in reverse there's extreme ex anxiety so it could go vice versa somebody could be extremely worried you know but you're being called to not let fear get in the way you got this big opportunity to let go of that fear let go of that fear. What, why are you letting fear get in the way? So fear is holding somebody back. Absolutely. One more card, please. I think there's been some sort of misunderstanding because what I see is the wall, right? The wall. A wall is a misunderstanding. Somebody has a wall up, which has caused some sort of misunderstanding. Um all tied up yes we have somebody here that is stuck they're stuck they don't know what to do they're not speaking they're not speaking they're not talking they're trapped um very very conflicted fears are a big part of this conflict so we have somebody that is fearful of opening themselves up looking for somebody to help wanting somebody to uh, rescue them, not taking the initiative to, you know, do what they need to do for themselves. That's what I see here. It feels like we got somebody here that is stuck. They are stuck. And, they're in the, and because they are so fearful, you know, they don't want to step outside of their comfort zone. They don't want to. They don't want to. This is comfortable where they're at. They're letting uh, fear and anxiety get in the way of their own freedom. Okay, so we have somebody here that is stuck in their head, stuck in their thoughts, definitely overthinking, thinking too much. This does have to do with a partnership. Okay, it has to do with a connection. I feel like we have a connection that is going south by the looks of things. I feel like it may have started out as a caring connection, as kindred spirits where, you know, it seemed perfect, but now things are going south. And they're going south because I feel like there's fear in the way. There's fear. There's too much overthinking. There's overanalyzing. I think there's a lack of communication. Um, let's see what else we got here. I think there's a big change that is needed, and we and it's scary. This change is scary. Justice. Justice is the need to make a decision. This is a card of uh, finality, making a decision, doing what's right. This is also a card of karma. It is a card of karma. 
legalities and being honest and upfront. Somebody needs to be honest and upfront and come with the truth. You know, uh, there's two sides to everything. I feel like we have somebody here that is not looking at something from another person's perspective. This is also a card of consequences. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta think of it this way. It's like, the laws of karma sees straight through a situation. So this is seeing straight through. This is the law. Okay, this is the law. And this could be universal law. It could be karmic law. It could be a spiritual law. It could be um, earthly law, right? This is um, the truth. A decision being made based on the truth. This is a fair and just decision. There is no toleration for lies. None. None. There's no toleration for lies in the justice system. Once you get caught in a lie, it's over. So I feel as though, and this, there's, a, there's a, you know, this person is looking at the law. He's he's about to he's about to speak something. Going by the book. Somebody may be, you know, I don't know, something about the book. King of Cups reversed. Now we have somebody here that is cold, emotional, and withdrawn. They are not opening their heart. That is the sort of truth. That is the truth. We have somebody here that can't, doesn't know how to love. Emotionally withdrawn. But this justice card is you can't get away with lying. Somebody has been lying and they're not going to get, and they're not getting away with it. Put it that way. Somebody is not getting away. This is un, this is like, this this king of cups is somebody that is withdrawn doesn't have good intentions ace of rods now this the ace of rods is a new spark a new enterprise a new vision this guy is is uh walking the tightrope by the looks of things somebody is walking a tightrope um very skilled by the looks of things. We do have somebody here that is very skilled. Four of Cups reversed. Looking for somebody else. This is this is reversed. We have a person that is, is looking for somebody else right now. They've been in a disconsent discontent situation which has caused them to withdraw emotionally it's like they've already made up their mind they have and now they're they're looking this guy is what the hell is he doing he's made a decision he's 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 uh going he's looking this is a new partner and this is seizing a new opportunity we have somebody here that isn't happy in their contract because this is a contract and they are active this is a book and this is a book somebody is is looking for something else something to do with a book here reading something hmm. now this is taking steps in a new direction it's got this new vision definitely seeing this is seeing, Ace of Wands is seeing, seeing, and this is a new opportunity, actually seeing some, instead of, instead of wasting more time, we have somebody here that is looking for somebody else. They're looking for another opportunity. Interesting. Eight of Cups saying goodbye. Somebody is definitely walking away from somebody, walking away from a relationship. They are. Somebody is being left behind. It's like the decision has been made. 
based on the facts because this is the facts based on the facts this person is emotionally unavailable I got to go I gotta go there's somebody else even though it hurts I gotta go now this is the ten of cups is a relationship but it's a ten so it's the end it's the end of a relationship because you know there's another one there's another one waiting there's another one right waiting so I think we have somebody here that has made a decision they have made a decision to walk away from a relationship because whoever they are dealing with is emotionally unavailable, doesn't communicate, is withdrawn, and maybe focused on somebody else. This person is focused on somebody else, and they're lying about it. Hangman reversed. Oh, my God. So this is refusing to go in, refusing to let go, obsessed with control. We have somebody here that is obsessed. They are obsessed. They're hiding something. And they are missing an opportunity. And this is missing an opportunity as well. Somebody has pissed this guy off, okay? There's, there's somebody here that is, is trying to teach somebody a lesson. I'm going to teach you a lesson. I'm going to go find somebody else. That's, that's it. I'm going to teach you a lesson. So somebody is... And maybe this is Facebook! Oh my fucking God, excuse my language. Because I was like, book, 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 what? And then it just came to me, Facebook. Hmm. So we have somebody here that is looking on Facebook. They're looking on Facebook. They are looking for another opportunity right now. They're try this is trying to teach somebody a lesson, obsessed with control and not learning their own lessons. Won't change. This is somebody who will not change. Very stubborn. Stubborn as hell. We have a very stubborn individual who, you know, the ace of wands, looking for like a new sexual partner or a new partner on Facebook. This guy is stubborn, stubborn, stubborn. Not emotionally available at all. And maybe this is karma coming for this person because this is a card of karma. This person may have found somebody. Okay? They may have already found somebody. They forced this person to walk away. They got into another relationship. And here comes karma. This is karma. Karma has no toleration for lies. A fair and just outcome will happen. It may or may not be in your favor. So we have this this person over here that uh, got this new vision, this new exciting opportunity. He he, it's like it's like he saw an easy opportunity. It looked like it was easy to me. Five of Wands competition, absolutely. We have a competition. Put, put competition. I mean, this is play games. Let's 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 explore the competition. I need some attention. Seeking. We have attention seeking individual here. I think there's going to be some, some, there's been some in-house fighting or there's been some sparring and there's been, you know, a tug of war, right? Or uh, these two happen to be arm wrestling, but there's been a lot of trying to, to prove themselves, trying to win, um, trying to prove themselves to the, to the ladies. I think we have somebody that has been wanted to teach somebody a lesson and and chose somebody that was a little flighty perhaps just to prove a point prove a point to somebody we have some sort of serious competition here this is a serious competition there's somebody here that thrives on competition, that loves competition. 
Look at me, look at me, look at me, look at me. Seven of rods. There's definitely some fighting going on here. Somebody's been fighting. Or there's going to be. There's going to be a fight. This is, this is a setback. This is stepping down, admitting defeat. This is feeling powerless. There's a fall from power here. Somebody is losing their grip, okay? They're losing. They're losing their power. They're losing their power because it feels like somebody... Uh, has probably decided to just walk away. I'm not going to compete. Seven of Swords. Yeah, I'm getting out of here. I, I'm I'm not doing this. Taking what? Taking and leaving. This is Seven of Swords. Is betrayal. Somebody is definitely feeling betrayed. We have somebody here that that is getting away with uh, a whole lot by the looks of things. But whoever it is that they are lying to can see it. They can see it. They know the truth. And karma can see it as well. So we have a very sneaky individual here that is in some sort of relationship. I feel like this person is is lying, stealing, thieving. Um, very skilled at what they do this person is uh could be a cheater this person um is very smart very 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 smart so we have a very smart individual here that thinks that everything is okay he thinks that he's got this in the bag he does he thinks he's got this in the bag but I don't think he does because I feel like if there's somebody that is thinking about stealing, maybe from an old person or a weak person or from anybody, I'm here to tell you there's a damn good chance you could get caught because we have a law here. Okay. So I feel like there is somebody that could get caught and they may end up being defeated. There is always somebody that is stronger than, than you. Okay? So I feel like there is... Somebody could... I mean, if, when the hangman comes up, that could be somebody ending up in jail. Seriously. You know, ankle ankle bracelets. Uh, this could be uh, punishment. Okay? The hangman could be punishment where you end up in jail or prison or something like that. There's a lesson that needs to be learned. So we could have somebody that ends up in a very unhappy situation where they wish that they didn't seize the opportunity that they thought was going to be easy because it's not easy. It, it didn't turn out the way that they had hoped. Somebody could definitely be going to jail. They could be getting locked up. There's no doubt about it. No doubt about it. They're going to get caught. And if it's not jail, they're going to get caught lying. Somebody's going to see them. Somebody is going to see them. They're going to get caught. Somebody's going to see what is going on. Um, <laughs> this is a fall from power. Somebody is has is going to uh, lose their power. They're going to... They're gonna, I don't know what happens. A fight could break out. There's definitely a fight could break out. And the cops come in. Just saying. Somebody tries to get away and they don't get away. They don't make it. Um, this person is very, very, very confident this guy is confident he's confident that he has got this in the bag he is confident but somebody sees him somebody sees him um somebody sees what he is doing this guy is planning on uh bringing the goods to another person that is aiding that is helping him
this person some this person is looking for a relationship obviously very beautiful very warm this guy is a cheater this person is a cheater a liar and a thief this one is completely unaware she is she not she doesn't even see it we have somebody here that doesn't even see that they are dealing with a liar a cheater and a thief this person is very very cunning they are very skilled at what they do this one needs to find their strength to turn around and see who this person is it's like this is almost like naive this person seems naive this is this is an exciting opportunity and and this person's being naive not realizing that they're dealing with somebody that isn't telling them the truth the one that is emotionally unavailable is looking for somebody a new sexual partner and that is it They're not emotionally available. You gotta be careful. You gotta be careful. So the justice is the first card out, which is a decision that needs to be made based on the facts. What the hell is this? Ooh, Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords is an ending. Bloodshed. Somebody's gonna get hurt. They're going to get hurt really, really, really bad. Looks as though they're going to walk away, though. They're going to walk away from a painful situation. So, be prepared for something to end that you refuse to acknowledge. It's like you refuse to acknowledge the facts. You refuse to see what it was. There could be a fight also. This could go in another route. This There could be a fight, a brawl, okay? There could be a brawl that ends with some sort of bloodshed. I just got to be honest. There is going to be a loss with the Ten of Swords. There's going to be a loss in the Ten of Cups. There's a relationship here where there has been some deception, right? There has. There's been a betrayal. There's, there's been another woman or another man or something like that. And that somebody may have engaged on Facebook and they or on someplace else and they get caught. They get caught. Or there's something to do with Facebook. There's something to do with Facebook here. But let's talk about that golden opportunity because I saw the Ace of Pentacles at the beginning. There's a golden opportunity waiting for you to go get it. But you have to take those steps to go get it. This is a big opportunity. Perhaps you have to walk away from something that <coughs> is deceptive to have that happily ever after. And that's going to take strength and it's going to take courage and it's going to take confidence to turn your back on somebody that lies and hurts you. So we do have the need to uh, look in a different direction. If somebody is lying to you and they are uh, looking for somebody else on Facebook while they're with you, you need to find your, you need to uh, do the right thing for yourself. Be honest with yourself and speak up for yourself. Don't stay trapped in a situation just because, you know, you don't want to be alone. There's no love in these cards. There isn't. The only love we have is over here. That's, 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 in this case, this tends to completions. We have a relationship that is completing because 
if you notice, there's there's like eight cups behind her and there's two cups in front. In front of her, there is another relationship. But the only way she's going to get it is to complete the current cycle that she is in that is hurting her, her or him. Somebody has been lying to themselves, they have, about a deceptive situation, refusing to see it. Anyway, um... We also have a big competition here. We have two people that are competing. This is a huge competition. There's another opportunity. Somebody loves the competition. They love it. They love the feeling. They love, they love the thrill of having all these people communicate with them or talk to them or watch them or whatever. It's, it's, that's kind of like a sickness. It's a feed my ego kind of energy. So we have somebody here that is really looking for another opportunity. And they may have found it. And they may have, you know, engaged with that person. Then we have this other person that's in denial. Anyhow, I feel like somebody is definitely getting caught or the truth is coming out. Because that is the truth coming out and a decision is being made. So a final decision is being made to walk away from a painful situation. I mean, that is the final decision based on the facts, based on the truth. To walk away from a painful situation. Somebody has been cheating themselves long enough. With somebody that. Obviously doesn't love them. We got the eight of cups here. That's walking away. There's cheating here. There's some sort of cheating or deception or something like that. And it's painful. It's painful. So I believe that. Um. Somebody has made a poor decision, and now they're about to uh, be faced. Because this is the this is justice is is it's time, it's time. They're going to be faced with the truth. Yeah, they they're going to be faced with the truth that you know breaks them and forces them to walk away. Yeah, good luck.